video, I am going to review and do a tutorial for you guys the Morphe 3503 Fierce by Nature palette. So this is brand new. It's in the box. It's kind of a little fucking rip because my brother ripped it out. Shout out to my brother. I love you so much. Um, but yeah. No, I don't. Um, yes, yeah, sir. This is what it looks like on the outside. So it kind of matches the vibe. I hate that word. This is 3503 Fears by Nature palette. And this is the colors on the inside. The, oh my god, like, the, it's so popping. Like, I, like, it's a different, like, when I first saw it, like, online, I was like, uh, it's like another, it's like the 3502, but, like, with a pop of green and a uh, glitter shade. But no, like, you have this neon orange this like fun pinky color this neon pink this glitter this green this green like you know like a little pops but they make the look pop if you know what i mean so i'm really excited to dig in and actually i have the 3502 to compare with so i'm gonna open both of them up real quick for you guys this is the 3502 i should i'm gonna put tape on the names right here so I could like so this won't be like flying away but let me see all right so these are the differences screenshot them right now do whatever you want I'm sorry if I'm not in frame all the way but yeah I'm like the sandwich screenshot it screen 3503 3502 these are the comparisons bitch Let's start off with this tutorial. So, the first thing I'm gonna do is prime my eyelids, of course. So I'm gonna do the Urban Decay Primer Potion, of course, in the shade Eden. This is my favorite, I love this. Oh, I forgot to fucking swatch them for you, I'm sorry. Let me do it real quick, sir. I'm gonna swatch the shit. You right now, if you're new to my channel, I like—I don't like to swatch the whole thing. I like to swatch some of my favorites that I like. So I'm gonna swatch this color right here. It's called Unstoppable. It's like this hot pink coral thing. It reminds me of Fruit Punch. Oh my god, these are really buttery. Like no shit, they stepped up their formula. Cause this is the newest palette they launched, and it's really buttery. What it looks like. Oh wow, she is coming for blood, mama. Look at that shit. The full pigment. Wow. Um, let's do ball of fire. This bright orange. Same creamy formula. Let's see. Alright, this one's a little cute. Cute. you know it's really good it's good let's do a dark color um, let's do this one it's called in command oh my girl oh, it's cute or what not you know it's a cute period and I'm gonna do a shimmer to wrap it up. Um, I'll be right back. Hey guys, I swear I need to buy an actual backdrop. Like that shit was such a mistake. I should have just bought a real fucking backdrop. Any fucking way. I'm sorry if I'm sweating too. I just like I'm really hot. I'm not really in a good mood, guys. I'm sorry, but I really want to make this video because. I just bought this palette yesterday and I really wanted to review it for you guys and I still have to review the Morphe and Jeffree Star palette and I'm gonna do some Halloween look so keep on watching hopefully um let's do this green color it's called power play um, oh it's move too it's like a goldish green real cute real cute It's 
it's not that cute. It's like a sheer shimmer, which scares me because I wanted to use that on like, I'm gonna do this crazy look. But I want to use that, so I feel like I'm not gonna use it anymore. So, not doing that anymore. Let's get on. So to start out this look, I'm gonna do the shade Smolder right here, and I'm gonna put it in my outer V, just to, you know, that's my little trick to do that little winged out effect. Especially if you have um, hooded eyes, this will be perfect for you. Cause you feel like really map out what you need to do. Holy shit, that's pigmented. Tad bit patchy over here. Maybe because I need to blend it in more, but right away that's what I noticed. take the shade Disrupt, which is right here, and I'm just gonna diffuse it, no harsh lines, you know me, ooh, ooh, when I tapped it in, a lot of kickback on the pan. I mean, I don't mind that, but, you know, just in case some people do, but it's like really pigmented. So, if a product has like a lot of kickback, that means it's pretty pigmented. This is where the graphic shit start. This is like the new technique. I'm gonna do a double cut crease. I saw this like style all over Instagram and I just really wanna do it for myself. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. Like honestly, it's my first time actually doing it. I didn't practice this or anything. So I'm gonna take this Morphe M2501 really thin brush and this is a MAC paint pot. I'm using this cause it's like really full coverage. So, fuck me, dude. Are you kidding me? I don't care. All right, anyway, bitch. Because I don't got time. Period. Fuck, I'll try. Bye, sis. You want to go too? I'll help you out. All right, so I'm going to try to do this line. a mess but I know I could clean it up so I don't know if it's gonna be a double cut crease to be honest because I don't know like I right, I'm like so confused <laughs> it's like my first time so all right I hope I don't fuck it up but if I do I'm sorry so I'm gonna take the shade unstoppable this pink like light neon brown night so, light neon pink fuchsia coral type of thing and I'm gonna Pat it on with this Morphe M124, and I'm just gonna, I'll change the plan. I'm gonna go bright today, okay? Sorry. And I'm gonna just pat it, pat, 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 ow. soft ochre paint pot and carve out like a regular cut crease so it's gonna be like pop pop so yeah
I told you that I'm gonna do a bright colorful look now so now that both sides are complete I'm sorry one of them are uneven. I think this one's uneven I'm sorry girl don't clock me but I'm gonna take this color called come alive which is this bright lime green and I'm gonna put it all over my lid and like do that little swoop and I'll type of thing with this look so let's get it cracking get my glitter glue where the fuck is my glitter glue glitter glue from NYX and I'm gonna just put some on where you know where like where the um where my where like right here that like we're on top of the red basically so I'm gonna apply some on with this little brush that I use to make the cut crease Once it got, once it gets tacky, I'm gonna take the glitter shade Make Believe right here, and I'm gonna use it on the same brush I put the glitter glue on, and just put it where you put the glitter glue on. Next up, I'm gonna put on my lashes now. And these are the Eyelore Vegas Nay Grand Glamour Lashes. This is my first time using these lashes. So I'll pop them on and I'll be right back. <laughs> All right guys, so this is my final look. using the 3503 from Morphe and I have to say I love this palette I think I like this palette more than the 3502 I'm sorry but I love this one it has pops of neons like I didn't even use no neutral browns well I did but like you know that was before I had the idea to go neon but bitch like I don't even need to go neutral with this palette. I could go neon. I could go dark. I could go berry. It has some berry colors in it. Like, dude, you could fucking do a lot of looks with this. It's really versatile. I love this palette so much. Um, this palette is an A plus to me. It's really passable. The only thing has a lot of fallout. Maybe I know why. Cause you see the fallout. I kind of did like something creative. I rubbed down my nose and shit. But you know, I had fallout because of this color. And obviously, cause I was packing it on. So next time I do like a double cut, a double cut crease look, I am gonna do it before I do my foundation. You know, my makeup just so I won't get no fallout and this mess. But anyway. This palette is really good. I mean, honestly, if you don't own the 3502 or the 350, snag this palette. And if it, if you do have the 3502, snag this palette because you have neons, you have a glitter shade, you have dark berry shimmers, you have you know your neutrals too, but you have more stuff to play with as well. So that's why I love this palette. It's passable. It's a plus, and that's on period. So if you guys like this video and like my makeup look, you already know what I'm doing. Give me a big up. Okay guys, I love you guys so much. And yeah, I love you my moon babies. <laughs>